Can you come a little closer? Up, up. Quickly! Get closer so you can see me. Northern Saskatchewan is teeming with cross-country skiers. Many schools have enough equipment to get all of the students out on skis. The winters are long, the snow is plentiful, the trails are expansive. And yet, there hasn't been someone from northern Saskatchewan cross-country skiing at a world-class level. This spring, four-time cross-country skiing Olympian Sharon Fur and her coach, <laughs> Anders Lennis, traveled to northern Saskatchewan to talk to kids about what it takes to compete at the highest level. The, kid, the people that go to the Olympics are the best of the best. They went to four Olympics. And, and our very, very first team was all Indigenous people. Are you proud? Firth is an Indigenous woman from the Northwest Territories, and many students were able to relate to her. Who goes to trap line here? Yeah. Okay. Look at that. Guess what? Dr. Sharon Ann Firth is a trap line kid. She grew up on the trap line. Lacloron Indian Band Chief Tammy Cook Searson so she's glad kids are having an opportunity to hear from the Indigenous role model. She said she hopes it inspires them to chase their dreams. And um, I think it's important to bring somebody like her. She grew up on a trap line and there's a lot of people that relate to trap lines and being in the bush. And I think it's important to encourage the youth to be the best that they can and to know that, you know, in order to be in the Olympics or, you know, if you want to be a top level athlete, it takes a lot of work and determination and, um, and, and lots of hard work. Practice, 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 eh? Practice makes perfect. It does. Oh, yes. <laughs> Many of the youth that Firth spoke with this spring expressed a desire to follow in her footsteps and become an Olympian. With some discipline and training, perhaps they just might. <laughs>